Hi, Libra. Eight of Wands. <laughs> Something's happening very quickly. There's movement. There are things afoot. Incoming. Um, <laughs> welcome to your Harsh Truth reading for April 17th through May 16th. Everything you need to know about this reading is in the description box below. A uh, shout out to, let's see, who, uh, Ramblin' Mike's Tarot channel on YouTube. I will put a link for his in the description box below. I don't know him, but uh, his name came up in the recommend a reader community thing that we got, that list we got going on, and I wanted to just bring attention to other people as well, so everybody finds a couple of options. So if you haven't had a chance, check him out. Check him out. All right, Libra. Harsh truth for Libra. Libra. The chariot. Forward movement. All right. Things working out. Forward movement. Victory by force of will. By marshalling two opposing forces. Um, and basically like <laughs> muscling them so that they can get cooperation and compliance and forward movement. This it, I hope this isn't about forcing it. When in doubt, force it. No. Let's, let's see here. Ace of Swords. Three of Swords. Two of Swords. What's going on? Nine of Wands. Eight of Coins. Nine of Swords. Good gracious. So we got two Nines. Yeah, that's it. Two Nines. That is Receipt. Right? Yeah, that's Receipt. Okay. All right. So get these. Okay. There's an impasse. We got an, we're dealing with an impasse here. Um, but so is it that you want to talk and and clear the air? Is that what's going on here? I hold on a minute. What's this three of swords about? Just three of swords about. I tweaked it a little bit. I tweaked the reading, so it's just three of swords. Doesn't make any sense. Ace, two, three. Interesting. It's just three of swords about for Libra. So I think they want an apology from you. I think they want. What's this ace of swords about? Okay, so both of these are about things resolving and forward movement and victory, right? And yet we have heartbreak and things being as they should be or an apology. Are, are they sorry and they want to apologize or they want you to apologize? What's this? Hello? No. Stop it. What's this? many cards. What's this two of swords about? What's this two of swords? It's, obviously this is, you know, an emotional issue. We got the three of swords and two of swords. What's this two of swords about? So this is a stalemate. We are at a stalemate. This is, there's been an ending and there's, there is no movement forward. So you're, I think you're wanting um, things to work out and for mo forward movement and victory. But I don't think that's going to happen. I think this person feels like you owe them an apology. Or maybe that they want to be able to apologize to you, but maybe they feel like it's not going to make any difference. This is whatever's happened between you two is a long time coming, though. Death is a process. This doesn't happen like this is not Ten of Swords. This, this is more like the Ten of Swords has happened emotionally. And now the, the aftermath is processing it emotionally and eventually you end up where there's no forward movement. But this has been going on for a while. Somebody's been feeling the disconnect or the pain or the hurt. Maybe you both have for quite some time. What's this Nine of Wands about? What's this Nine of Wands about? Okay, so we've got the star here. Nine of Wands and the star. So perhaps you are hopeful that even though there's been an ending, things are going to work out over time because we've got both of these cards are very hopeful, very positive, right? This is things resolving over time. This is getting what you want over time. This is things ending over a period of time. This is 
the yes card when the answer to how is yes right that's what this card is so i think you're 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 okay with things not moving forward now the stalemate but i think you do want things to work out or things to take a positive turn over time what is this knight of coins about what's this knight of coins this knight of coins libra wow okay so i they what well, hmm? Is it that they want to just be by themselves? We got solitary, solitary, hurting and solitary, and no movement for or things being as they should be, balance being restored. So unless there's an apology, this person just wants to be by themselves, or are they hoping that they're going to get an offer of security, there, which is basically you coming back or you being fair about something? And I just this just flipped. So that was a ten of pits. So this is about things balance being restored. This is about things being restabilized about um that stability that has ended being restored for this person that's what they want they feel like probably it's the right thing to do an apology there's something about an apology here whereas i think you're like you know what things are as they should be right now like over time but right now things have to be this way and yet they're kind of stuck they're kind of stuck this knight of coins here okay so what's this nine of swords about this nine of swords. So it's not, you know what? I'm going to use these. Hold on a minute here. Because I, I want to use these. Some, and I got the tarot dice I want to use also. So this nine of swords. All right. We've got, got two nines here. That's receipt. Probably that means that you're understanding that things are as they should be. Whereas they're looking at it. Yeah, no, I want the apology. Or I want to come back and be able to make things right. Or I want someone to come back, make things right, and restore stability. And you're like, nah, I don't think that's what working out for us means. I don't think that that's what victory for us means. Maybe you're thinking if you have that clarifying conversation or that honest talk, it'll clear the air. But And, and you'll be defensive or you'll be like, okay, I'm coming from a position of strength here. We've been through a lot, but I mean what I say. There is stability. And yet we've got this ending in a stalemate. And then we've got a bunch of anxiety and it's like the nightmare card and things piling up. So no matter, okay, is this wishful thinking, Libra, on your part? Like, okay, I'm going to come back with this apology and restore stability and make it right, but it's not going to be right, is it? So this is either an ending you're okay with or you are hoping that things will work out, out over time. And even though you're feeling kind of defensive, there's also strength to this. There's also like, you know what, we can do it. Let's have some faith. Let's, you know, giddy up mofo let's do this and yet this is someone that is kind of i don't know i i don't this is solitary but i think they want an offer of stability again i think that's what it, they want you to come back in and restore and you're just like whatever happens leads to this right here this is a stalemate and then this is the anxiety so okay all right what is your part in this? What is your part in this Nine of Swords? Let's do that. Let, here we go. What's your part in this Nine of Swords? <laughs> Giddy up, mofo. I don't, I don't know where this <laughs> What's this Nine of Swords about for Libra? <laughs> that's not funny. I'm sorry. I just, that was a little out of, um, that was... I was out of left field. All right, so we got the Nine of Cups here, the Nine of Swords. Okay. So this is about them coming back in and wanting to be, wanting to, there's a lot of emotion that's being kind of controlled or curtailed behind this offer, taking things to the next level. The, this you know this person doesn't feel like they're doing too well with this well obviously the three of swords but okay so that's them then what is yours then and i know i said this was yours but that's not how i what is yours then? they want you to come back in or they want they want an emotional offering from you or they want to be able to make an emotional offer but there's something that feels like you're not approachable to them Again, with the restoring balance, 
Either they want you to come back in and restore balance or they want to be able to give you what they think you want, which is an emotional offer, so that balance will be restored. They really want this relationship back. And there's a lot of anxiety. Um, I don't know, though. I don't feel like you're into it. What? What is... You've broken their heart. This is Libra. Okay, I get that. This is all about things being restored and stability. And I think you are definitely in the driver's seat here. You kind of have the power in this situation quite clearly. They're either depending on you to come back and open up to them emotionally, or they want to be able to open up to you emotionally um, so that stability can be restored after this ending and things are at a stalemate and there's no communication. So what would they say to you? What would, what would Libra's person say to them? What would Libra's person say to them? Libra's person say to them? What would Libra's person say to them? I'm not the same person that you remember. Well, what are you, broke? Because, I mean, th this is... Somebody's really wanting that security again. And I know that I don't, this could be Scorpio, this could be Leo, Aquarius, but I don't understand. Um, this feels needy to me and I'm cross watchers. I'm sorry. It's very intense. This right here, this is very intense. This could be somebody that's really having trouble with the relationship being, uh, having ended or this stalemate where there's no communication. But we've got this positive attitude over here from you, Libra, like everything's going to work out. It's going to be okay. Whether that means you moving on or you reuniting with this person, but you're in a much better place emotionally than this person is. And I think there's like some, it's almost like, well, they really want sort of, I want to say groveling, but this, this is very clear cut and decisive over here and very positive. This person feels like they're, they're kind of, I, God, I don't want to say petty. I'm going to say petty. I don't want to say it. But like they're just, they're really wanting to know that, that they can kind of lock you down. I hate to say that. I, but this right here, this is somebody that um, is really wanting, there's a lot more emotion behind the offer than meets the eye. And things over here are very simple, but with this offer, it's much more nuanced and complex and layered and deep and kind of possessive, if I'm honest. It's kind of possessive, okay? And, you know, I'm not the same person that you remember. Well, I don't know, Libra. I, I don't know. Maybe that's why this Nine of Swords is here, because it doesn't feel right. Something is not right. It feels like this person is going to be a bit possessive. It feels like they're kind of needy. And I don't mean to be disrespectful. Um, when they say they've changed, I'm like, wait, what? Because how and why, this doesn't feel changed. This feels like you're just kind of prettying up the emotional neediness. You're coming in all hot or you're wanting an offer that's all kind of, you know, and here you are all pretty on this, you know, unicorn, right? Doesn't exist. That's a red flag. And everything's great, but it's they said the behind it. There's, there's a moon there. I Shutting up, I'm, I'm, yep, okay. All right, what does Libra need to do? No, let's do that. What does Libra need to know? There it fell. Look at that. What does Libra need to know? Awesome. Yep, why don't I close the bag the other way? What does Libra need to know? Two dice, what does Libra need to know? Okay. So when they're like this, I just want you to know, I always turn them clockwise. So that is because this is not the right. Okay, so tower and justice, which is saying this destruction, this upheaval is as it should be. The right thing has taken place. It is right and proper that there is upheaval and um, things are are kind of leveled right now. I'm telling you something's not right, Libra. It's very simple over here. Over here it is not. Not that they're a bad person, but this feels very possessive to me. This this person coming in or wanting you to come in and make this offer after this ending. And and there's a chance there's transformation here. We got transformation. There's been an ending. It's been a slow ending. Things have changed. They're probably right. I'm not the same person you remember because you can't not be when you go through this. When this comes up, this is about transformation on the other side. But this there's something off. I don't think the core things have changed. I think this this feels very possessive to me. 
and it's it's raising a red flag for me. All right, so we got the tower and justice here. Things are as they should be with this upheaval. So perhaps this is you moving on, not with this person. I um, Libra, two cards, please. Snapshot for Libra. Okay, so someone's going to be um, wanting to talk about their feelings. Obviously, they're going to want recognition for their feelings, but this is also, this could be a new love interest. Um, this could be somebody that's just kind of wish-washy, wishy-washy, that kind of goes back and forth about what they want. So maybe that's why the Nine of Swords, the Nine of Swords is here and the Nine of um, Wands is here. Maybe that's why things have ended because somebody, maybe somebody comes in like this but then once things are solid and stable, then they kind of become absent emotionally. So that's why they turn it on like gangbusters here or that the need for that, someone making that offer or showing someone showing that, whatever, is what it's going to take to restore stability because there's, there's a, kind of an absent. It's like this. It goes like this. And it's not because we've got recognition and talking about feelings here. The moon is different than it is in the tarot deck. But it's... This is also, this could be attraction. This could be, you know, having feelings for somebody, that sort of thing. But it's not, it's wishy-washy. It's back and forth. It's not, this is not somebody, somebody in this situation is not emotionally available. Somebody is not wanting the stability and the level of emotional connection that the other person is wanting. And perhaps it was you, Libra, that wanted this emotional connection and this stability from the person because they're like, I'm not the same person I remember. It's okay. Things are going to be good. But is it? Because we've got the Nine of Swords here. And it's, it's based on someone opening up emotionally and with that opening up, that makes somebody feel secure. So to what level is that going to need to take place constantly all the time? This feels like there's been an absence of it to so where the only way it's going to be made up is if somebody kind of has this turned on all the time. Like this sort of knight in shining armor or this emotional outpouring and kind of Shutting up. All right, now I've got to find the two dice that fell here. <laughs> okay, so I, I hope this was helpful. It's kind of all over the place. I can't help it, Libra. I got red flags. I'm sorry. I, I mean no disrespect. I know how I know how it is, but just please be careful, okay? I, 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 I can't put my finger on it. Everybody's situation is different, but something is not, doesn't fit. Something is not as it seems there. It's not as it seems. You be careful, please. Yes. Okay. All right, Libra. Thank you. 17 minutes. Good gracious. 18 minutes. Thank you. Um, I hope to see you in the next reading. You take care, okay?